Hey there, it's Ryan. Today, we've got something super useful for you. Have you ever been stuck with a phone that just won't accept a SIM card from a different network? Yeah, I know, it's a hassle. But don't worry, I've been there, and that's why I'm here to help. We're diving into the world of unlocking your Verizon phone. And guess what? These tricks aren't just for Verizon. They work perfectly on any carrier, anywhere in the world, regardless of your phone's brand. Whether you're an Android fan or an iPhone user, this guide's got you covered. We're going to explore several easy ways to break free from those annoying carrier locks. You know, those locks that keep you tied to one network and don't let you switch to a different SIM card? Yeah, we're getting rid of those. And the best part? You don't need to be a tech wizard to follow along. So, sit back, relax, and let's unlock the full potential of your phone together. This is going to be fun, and by the end of this video, you'll be ready to switch networks like a pro, no matter where you are or what carrier you're dealing with. Let's get started. Just a quick information before we dive in. This video is for you if you're using it the right way. It's perfect for folks who legitimately own their phone and just want to switch carriers. What we're not about is helping with shady stuff like messing with security on phones that aren't yours. Always play by the rules and respect others' property. Plus, everything we're sharing is totally in line with YouTube's rules and community standards. All right, with that said, let's get back to the fun part. The unlock services we're talking about mainly work in first world countries. Now, if you can't access these services or prefer not to use them, no worries, we've got you covered. Every week, we're giving away 250 unlocks to our viewers. Want in? It's super simple. Just like this video, hit the subscribe button and drop a comment below. In your comment, make sure to mention your phone model, like iPhone 12, always, your IMEI number, and the country you're from. That's it. Once you've done these steps, you're automatically entered into our weekly draw. Good luck. Let's walk through how to use Carrier Switcher, a handy online tool for unlocking your phone from its current carrier. First, head over to CarrierSwitcher.com. Once you're there, you'll see a green button. That's your gateway to getting started. After clicking the green button, you'll be asked to enter your name and email. This step is crucial because it's how they'll assign the order to you. Make sure to use a real email address. You'll receive a confirmation code there. Next up, you'll select the manufacturer of your device, like Samsung or Apple. This helps the app understand what kind of phone you're unlocking. Now, it's time to enter your phone's IMEI number. If you're not sure how to find it, here's a quick tip. On most modern phones, you can find the IMEI by dialing star hashtag 06 hashtag. It should pop up on your screen. Jot that number down and enter it into the carrier switcher. Before moving on, you'll need to confirm that you're acting in accordance with their terms of service and that the device you're unlocking isn't stolen. It's all about keeping things legal and above board. Hit Continue to finalize the process. You'll see a confirmation that your unlock is ready and they'll also send a confirmation email to you. In your email, you'll find instructions and an access key. This key is pretty awesome. You can use it as many times as you like for unlimited downloads. Follow the steps provided in the email on how to use this access key. And that's how you get the ball rolling with Carrier Switcher. Stay tuned for more tips and tricks on making the most out of your devices. Apart from using tools like Carrier Switcher, there are several other ethical and legal methods to remove the carrier lock from your phone. One common approach is directly contacting your carrier. Most carriers will unlock your phone for free, provided you've completed your contract or paid off the device in full. It's a straightforward process. Call your carrier's customer service or visit their website to request an unlock. They might ask for some details like your account information, and the phone's IMEI number. Usually, they'll send you the unlock instructions via email. Another option is using third-party unlocking services, but be cautious and choose reputable ones. Look for services with good reviews and a strong track record. These services usually charge a fee and require your phone's IMEI number to process the unlock. The process can vary, so follow their specific instructions carefully. For those who are a bit tech-savvy, there's also the DIY method, using unlocking software. This requires a bit of technical knowledge, as you'll be downloading and using software to unlock the phone yourself. It's crucial to use reliable software to avoid any potential harm to your device. Research thoroughly and follow the software's instructions step by step. Remember, 
Unlocking your phone should always be done legally and ethically, respecting the terms of your contract with your carrier and the law. This ensures you stay out of trouble and keep your device safe and functioning. Stay tuned as we explore more about making the most of your mobile devices. Thanks for tuning in. We hope you found this guide helpful in unlocking your phone. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more useful tips and tricks. Your support means a lot to us. If everything worked out smoothly with your phone, or if you've got any questions, feel free to drop a comment below. We love hearing from you and are here to help with any queries you might have. Stay connected for more content like this. And remember, your feedback helps us keep bringing you the best advice and solutions. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.